The following contest is a two Guys, we have a big time tag match. team match coming up here. A big time match first, with big time stakes, Michael. Texas, Neither one of these superstars can afford a loss right now. 280 pounds, Mac Daniel. And his partner from Kansas City, Missouri, weighing in at 245 pounds, the King Harvey Rays. This is the one this crowd has been waiting for, guys. Tag team action coming up. I can't wait, Michael. Like this crowd, I've had my eyes on this match ever since it was announced. at a combined weight of 524 pounds, National Stampede Heavyweight Adam West and Clark Kent. Both legal men are in the ring Ouch. and set to start things off here. We're ready to go. Doesn't get any better than this. We're about to witness tag team oh, action man. at its finest, fellas. You know, even though the title is not on the line, this is still an important match for the champ. He can't afford to show any weakness here. Jeez. Byron Calf Crusher's in. Cinched in, nowhere to go. Tag made. We've seen some great chemistry from this team here, Michael. Yeah, incredible chemistry. Oh, and Enziguri. Uh -oh. oh, my goodness, crushing it. Strong oh, kick. My goodness.
There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have formed and over time they develop and bond and become an outstanding tag team combination. The team that immediately comes to mind is the powerhouse duo of Cesaro and Sheamus. After their thrilling best of seven series, I wouldn't think they'd develop into a top tag team. Oh, look at this, locked in. Submission move here. He's starting to show signs of fatigue. He's going to have to cut off his opponent's offense quickly. Well, I don't think anyone thought Cesaro and Sheamus would develop into a premier tag team. Over time, the superstars realized that they were better as allies than as enemies. And when they combined their incredible strength, the results were something that couldn't be ignored. It was really unbelievable to witness the evolution of Cesaro and Sheamus as a team. We saw them improve every week and conquer a variety of opponents. To see the Swiss Cyborg and Celtic Warrior go from unwilling partners to WWE Raw Tag Team Champions was truly impressive. For many years, members of the WWE Universe and the WWE locker room have felt that tag team matches should have two referees. One referee is in the ring overseeing the action, and the other is located out on the floor, making sure teams follow the rules and do not engage in potentially damaging behavior. I think it's a good idea, something perhaps Mr. McMahon might want to consider. Byron, well, earlier you raised a point that people have been talking about for years, and that's a second referee being appointed to tag team matches. I remember WWE Hall of Famer and former WWE President Gorilla Monsoon used to express his strong advocacy for two referees being appointed to tag team matches. Uh, it's something that's been talked about for decades, Michael, and I don't think it's ever going to happen. We've seen it on occasion, but I think it's best to let the superstars be responsible for themselves. And the appointed official for the match needs to do the job they're paid to do. I don't think it's that much to ask. Ah, he's got that boot right up against oh, his face. Come on. Knee drop. That was nasty. So precise. They can't walk after that attack to the back. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. He's starting to feel it here. He came into this match expecting a fight, and that's exactly what he's getting. Well, it's not dire consequences for him here, which is good. But just in case, he might want to think about getting his partner in there for a bit. This isn't his first rodeo. He had to expect to take on some offense here tonight. Beautiful technique. There's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Big time impact from way up high. Tagged in. Whoa, down he goes. That was impressive, Cole. In off the tag. Uh -oh. The oh my goodness, crushing it! <laughs> He's on the defensive here. This tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he wow. doesn't mount an offense soon. He's doing exactly what he didn't want to do here. He's letting his opponent right back into this match. What a stop! Good grief! Legal. Got him up. Big time atomic drop. I don't have you walking funny. In order to be a premier tag team, a superstar and their teammate must have that continuity where they're a well-oiled machine inside the ring. I'm talking about classic techniques, like cutting the ring in half, isolating your opponent, relegating them to your corner, and making frequent tags so that the fresh man is always in the ring. That's how you keep your opponents off balance. Corey, a few moments ago, you took us through what it takes for a tag team to be successful. The continuity between tag team partners is crucial. When a team is able to keep one opponent in the ring for an extended period of time without making a tag, they're able to focus their attack on one individual and one body part. And that's when things really start to take shape if you're on the tag team that's in control of the match. 
When you look at the tag teams who have dominated this business, all of them worked well together as a unit and were able to keep an opponent in the ring long enough to make that adversary the focal point of their assault. During the rivalry between the Hulk, here he goes. Only one place to go when you're stuck in the fireman's carry. Yeah, down. And I can tell you it's not a pleasant trip. The slam! I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Going for broke. Vicious attack. Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. The two out of three falls match to saw the Hardy Boys go at it. There's the cover. Can he do it? Oh, and he breaks up the pin. Oh, man, that hurt the back. Spine rattling. Boom, what impact. Impact. Oh, what a snap there. Oh, perfectly executed. One of superstars in a tag team match and has endured heavy amounts of him. What a clothesline. Ouch. Oh, it's over. Nasty kick to the face. I knew it was only a matter of time. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Well, better not think too long, though. My impactful slam! This one's over, guys! He goes for the cover. Ooh-wee! He's looking a little weary here. If they want to win this match, he really needs to make a tag soon. If you told me heading into this match that he was going to absorb so much punishment, I would have called you a liar. Especially you, Saxton. But then again, I never believe anything that comes out of your mouth. At this point, they both look to be about evenly matched. Maybe I'd give him an edge, but not by much. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Here we go a second time. Oh, the damage to the body. But I don't know how much gas he has left, guys. an impressive tag team victory. Now let's take a look back at some of the great action. Almost forgot about this one. Man, this was great. Man, oh man, look at that. And here's the last look at this one. Here are your winners, Adam West and Clark Kent. Nice teamwork by these two here tonight. Wow, I can't believe the amount of punishment that had to be inflicted in order for those shoulders to stay down for the three count. We may be in New Orleans tonight, but I assure you there was nothing easy about that win right there.